My name is Greg. I am from the United States and I am 61 years old. I was diagnosed with MS, multiple sclerosis. The symptoms I was uh, experiencing was my, my stability, my longevity. Um, I couldn't walk for more than 20 yards without having to take a seat and rest my legs. And I was having a hard time walking around. Um, I was using a cane. Um, I, being an active person, I was not able to do the things that I was able to do as a younger adult. Um, when I got diagnosed with MS, I was put on certain drugs that weren't helping. They were just maintaining and even making me feel even worse. As his wife or a loved one, anyone, um, you don't want to see anybody going down. It's devastating to all parties involved, but especially the person with it. Um, so you've got to be there for them. Um, and I wasn't going to go let him go down without a fight. We decided, my wife and I, that we needed to look at it, all their alternatives because it felt we were going down a uh, wheelchair hole. I did not want to be in a wheelchair. Um, a neighbor across the street had mentioned the Stem Cell Institute. Had we looked into that? Um, my wife looked up the Stem Cell Institute, and when, that's when that's when our journey began in investigating what stem cells could actually do for me. After my first stem cell in, uh, infusion, I did not need the cane anymore. It felt great. It felt invigorating. I felt like my old self. It was very enlightening and enjoying. My enunciation of words seemed to be better. Uh, my clarity on trying to get my thoughts out came out better. Um, I was able to uh, pronounce words and get my thoughts across in a timely and efficient manner that people could actually uh, understand what I was t uh, talking about. And in the seven years that I've had the stem cells, my MRIs have shown no activity and no new, new lesions or uh, enlargements, and so we're doing good on that aspect. Him being able to walk with his head held high, um, participate in activities with our daughter, um, the shopping mall, for instance, with her, you know, um, I'm able to see that he's having a more pl pleasurable life, um, a more confidence at work, and to see him after this and how good he feels, see it in his face, hear it in his voice. You could tell it was 100% difference right off the bat. My family and friends um, have reacted to when, when I come back is um, they ask if I'm you know, able to play golf anymore, which I have started again. Um, you know, that was one thing that it was challenging when I first was diagnosed with MS. I could swing and try to do a golf club backwards and I would lose balance. After the first stem cells, I was able to go to a driving range and I hit a ball and I was not able to, I did not fall down. Um, my family and friends have been very supportive. The entire experience has been um, beyond what we could have imagined. It's just been amazing. It's been amazing. Um, the whole wrap up from arrival um, to the end, to my husband's progress, um, more than we could have imagined um, before we arrived. It was made to be the best experience and the best choices we've ever made. What I would recommend to anyone considering stem, cell and, uh, stem cells, give it a try. I mean, what have you got to lose? Um, I was skeptical when I first came, um, thinking, oh, uh, just another procedure. This will be the fifth or sixth one. And when I got done with it, it was night and day. It really opened my eyes up. Now, it's not really a cure but it will give you your quality of life back. Um, you know, I don't, you know, I'm, I'm sure it might not work for everybody, but if you're, if you're at that point in your life to try, try it, uh, you will not be disappointed. It's heartfelt. And like I said, seeing your, seeing your loved one be able to stand up and hold his head high, that's kicking, that's good stuff, you know? It makes everybody feel good. Your kids, his mom and dad, his brothers, sister-in-laws, nieces, nephews, you know, it's, you're still able to be active with your family. What more could you want from that?